What the dog doing? Well, hello and welcome and welcome back. Uh, today I'm just out and about. Uh, pretty crisp day. A little cool, but pretty nice for, for a walk. So I thought I'd uh, head out and take a walk down Rio Grande Boulevard and see if we can find some interesting uh, buildings or some interesting spots. And I hope you can. Uh, join me through the whole trip so let's go i believe this is the old uh, keebler keebler crackers and uh cookie factory I'm pretty sure I believe it's empty now but uh, it was here quite some time for a long time Okay, we made it down to Rio Grande Boulevard. Finally. Gonna take uh, Rio Grande, uh, going south a little bit before we go north. See if we can find anything interesting over there. Don't know how safe this is to be walking around this area, but uh, it's kind of close to a tourist area, so it's probably okay. But you really have to keep your eyes out. Uh, I try to highlight all the interesting uh, spots around town around Albuquerque the artwork and interesting uh, old buildings But you have to keep in mind I read recently that Albuquerque is fifth uh, Fifth in the nation for violent crimes unfortunately so That's one negative Got to take the good with the bad in every city I guess Okay, we're close to Central. It's pretty cool artwork over here. Always got to take a picture of the graffiti and different items. Interesting little uh, porch covering or so up there. Well, in my uh, my video adventures over the last year or so, I've gone to some pretty sketchy areas. Made me a little nervous, but uh, I haven't had any real problems. I've had a couple people kick me off their property or kind of made me nervous, but uh, nothing too bad. I've lived here most of my life. In fact, uh, I lived quite a few years in the what they call the war zone. I did a video of that uh, a little while back and uh, got a, quite a few views. Got over a thousand views there. Not as many as my Spirit Halloween store. That, got, <laughs> For some reason that got over 6,000 views. But uh, you never know what people are going to tune into and I hope you Hope you enjoy my walk around, looking at interesting items around Albuquerque. I've driven by this place many times. 
never checked it out. Pretty uh, colorful, pretty interesting. I love it. Casa Flamenca, not sure what that is. And that's what I call a fancy bus stop. It's not just a little blue cage. Nice little area. People that get out of the rain and get out of the sun. Oh, I never even knew this existed. Been by here a million times. Old Town Founder and Gateway Park. Just a small little park, but uh, it's a city park nonetheless. Very noisy. But I love to explore city parks. And uh, in fact, I have a playlist of all the city parks that I've reviewed and checked out. Oh, this is pretty beautiful. Let's make a nice little entrance to your home. Got the Zia Sun there. And in honor today of New Mexico, I've got my Zia Sun hat. Ah, it's a law firm. I just love this store. They have so many interesting items. I've shown this several times in my videos, but uh, while I'm in the area, I just can't pass it up. So colorful. Got some movement here. If you want to brighten up your yard or your landscaping, uh, definitely the place to go in between Central and uh, I-40. Some mariachis up there. Dinosaur. Oh, I don't think I've noticed this before. Look at the beautiful benches. I just love those. I'd love to have those in the, like a courtyard or out back. Awesome. We've got a nice painting on the wall here. How colorful some of these are, these benches. There's some back there too. Got a cool old truck here. Next door here looks like we have some uh, sculptures, some molds made out of metal. There's a Statue of Liberty. How'd you like that in your yard? Okay, now we're down to uh, Bellama. I'm just going to walk to uh, I-40 today and it'll be quite a walk. It is so chilly out here. Really cold. My eyes are watering. <laughs> Wind kicked up. Then walking by the cars here too. Noisy and whipping up the, the wind. But it's worth it seeing some pretty cool spots. You really do have to get out of the car and park and walk around. There's so many things that you drive by a million times. Even in your hometown, small town. It's just so used to driving by and seeing things, but you really can't see them until you get up close. And there's things that you've never even seen before. Whether interesting or not, but uh, it's 
pretty cool that you can see them when you take your time walk slow yeah there's a uh, quite a few shops back here Won't be darned it's a clock up there looks like it says about 7 30 but that is not correct I would have never known this was here if I didn't go walking around. Yeah, they got like a gazebo back here. That's very well hidden. Not sure what they use it for. Nonetheless, it's pretty cool. I love this old uh, architecture. I call it Northern New Mexico architecture for some reason. Okay, we've made it to our destination. I-40 in Rio Grande. I wanted to show this plaque here. I just have to zoom in. There's some guy over there yelling at cars, so don't want to get too close. But uh, check out these towers that were put in quite a few years ago. There's one on that side and one on the other. I've shown those before in some previous videos. Uh, I guess people complained about those when they first went up, but I haven't heard much from them and I really can't find anything uh, much online either uh, about them, but I kind of like them. You know you're at Rio Grande when you're on the uh, on I-40 and they're pretty cool at night. You've got the, some lights in there that light up, uh, uh, blue, purples, reds, and uh, so it's pretty cool. This is our final destination. Well, I was able to cross Rio Grande, which I don't rec recommend crossing on foot. It's quite dangerous. Cars got pretty close to me. Well, that's gonna do it for this video. We took a walk from about central on uh, Rio Grande Boulevard all the way to I-40. Checked out the uh, sculptures, the towers and some interesting things on the way. Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. And thank you for watching till the end. I really appreciate that. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button, and that like button, comment, share, all that fun stuff. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to grow the channel. And uh, it's time to head on back to the car. Take care. Bye now.
What the dog doing?